Hi folks, um, single cell charger update. It's working really, really good. Um, the reason why it wasn't working before the bridge rectifier is that the diodes I was using were the wrong diodes. So since then I've changed the diodes to the right diodes and it's working really, really well. End result with the uh, volt output is 3.75 and hooked to a 2 volt cell is approximately about 20 amps from a dead cell that is and I have an old box here it's a 24 volt charger it's just an empty box but it still has the the face gauges on it and the switches and whatnot so I'm going to try and incorporate some of these buttons and lights and gauges within the charger itself the amp meter is only reading it's up to an 8 amp so I may have some difficulties there I may have to increase the amp meter so I'm not too sure if I'm going to or not, but uh, we'll see. Time will tell. I might make a third video, but it's working well. So I just need to incorporate it in the box and get my uh, positive clamps and my negative clamps on the uh, charging leads here. And here it is, folks. Worked out well, and I'm very satisfied with it. Thank you for watching, and subscribe if you will. And for those that you have, thank you. Okay, another little update on this um, single cell 2 volt charger. Here's the, all oh, everything's in place, tucked away nice and neat, all taped up and secure, and here's the flip lid, and here's my cable ends, and unfortunately I wasn't able to use the lights, they're uh, DC power and it doesn't produce enough DC power, so too low a voltage, which that's okay, I'm going to turn it on and you'll hear it hum. So that's a pretty good indicator it's on. Okay, get out of the way, Chewy. I'm going to, I'm going to show some sparks here. Go out of the way. Okay, I'm going to flick, flick the switch and, and, and start it up. And here's the uh, arcs that are produced. Thank you for watching everybody.